Hello, I'm Mark from Bosworth Property Marrakesh, and today we're in the Dar El Basha neighborhood, one of Marrakesh's most sought after residential areas. Beautiful, clean, quiet street, a dead end, and a very recently renovated Riyadh. Uh, beautiful condition, even the outside. Sometimes in Marrakesh, the outside of a house doesn't reflect what the inside looks like, but in this case it does. Nice uh, hand-finished terracotta bricks on the outside, but come in and uh, have a look. It's an unusual entrance in that there's a few steps up from street level. Quite often in Marrakesh you find yourself stepping down. This is the, uh, the opposite. There's a big entrance hall, plenty of storage, nice ceiling heights. This is a little cloakroom, actually quite a big cloakroom. And then we go up again into the central courtyard. Nice big airy light space, open plan kitchen. I love these traditional ceilings as well. All very neutral tones. This is a very fashionable look, a traditional tiles everywhere. This is uh, Zilij Beldi all made just outside Marrakesh. Unusually here, the uh, courtyard's been covered over as well. There's a glass roof above us, despite which on a hot day, we're nice and cool here thanks to the air conditioning. But it means that you can really use this central space, even in bad weather, not that we have very much bad weather, it remains usable. No dust, no problem. It's uh, about 76 square meters on the ground, this house. It's titled, all the paperwork in order. So a ground floor bedroom. This is a double room. It's being arranged as a little salon at the moment, but there is space for a double bed in there. It's air conditioned, and there's an ensuite bathroom behind us. I'll just show you the other side of the kitchen as well. The kitchen's nice. You know, if you like to cook, it's a great space to cook and entertain at the same time. And there is a uh, big storage area in here. That, this is full of stuff, but it goes up and right the way back to the outside wall. Loads and loads of space. So, let me take you upstairs. So here we are on the first floor. Really nice shaded seating area here. This is traditionally like a winter seating area uh, because it's a little warmer up here. A uh, nice view of the courtyard. Lots and lots of light and space. And I like all these uh, wrought iron window grills and things, all very traditional. You've got a great double bedroom in there. Ensuite bathroom. All three bedrooms have en suites. They're all proper double rooms. No tiny box rooms. sweet house and you've got another great double bedroom air conditioned they're all air conditioned they're all en suite lovely traditional ceilings although I, in this case the traditional ceilings are a decoration there is a, uh, a concrete ceiling above that one So that's the first floor, or second floor if you're American. Then we're gonna go up again to the terrace level. So here we are on the terrace level, roof terrace, beautiful, bright, sunny space. You've got a uh, jacuzzi or hot tub at the end here. 
It's full of cactuses at the moment, each to their own, but uh, that is reinforced to take the weight of water. You can see the glass roof. And there is actually the potential to uh, create a viewing platform above us here. So you could, if you wanted to, go up to an extra level. Um, but there we have it. Beautiful house, uh, wonderfully designed. This is 76 square meters footprint. It's Dar el Basha, one of the nicest areas of Marrakesh. It's 290,000 euros, and I've no doubt it will sell extremely quickly. So call us now.